going, folks, now this is a bit of a silly one, alright? Some of you might think they're all silly, but anyway. I was talking to my, my mate the other day when we was on a job, as you do, as we do quite frequently. And and we was we were we just finished at sorting uh, this, this this elderly couple I had a few problems with. My boss said, you got to go and sort them out. Anyway, I don't know what else got to do with anything. <laughs> but I noticed on their, their kitchen, they had, they had a bottle of oil, see. I said to my mate, do you see that big bottle of oil they had? He said, yeah. I said, well, doesn't that make you think about where oil comes from? He said, well, that was, that, that, that was, that was from plants, wasn't it? I said, yeah. I said, but what about all these, all these supposed fossil fuels? I said, I said, I've heard it's a bit of a misnomer to call uh, oil, mineral oil, fossil fuel, see? So he says, oh, I. I says, well, yeah. I says, it is a hydrocarbon substance. I said, but they keep finding it all over the world. How come, pretty much wherever they drill, they find oil? See, because it's Alaska, the Antarctic, the Arctic, Russia, we've got some over here, up in the North Sea and down in the South, down here. Um, it, it, it's all over the place, oil. Africa's got it, South America's got it. Nice Arab people, they got it. Even down in Indonesia, I think they got some as well. Chinese, I think, have got some. I'm in the Gulf of Mexico. It's all over the place, this oil. And I got to think about this. And I said to myself, well, I said, I, I, I sat there, I went quiet a bit. He says, what's the matter? You, you, I thought you were going to tell. I said, I was just having a think. I said, you think of all them tectonic plates? Right, you've got all them continents, and they're all they're all moving around, aren't they? I said to him, I said, how do you think they move around? Then I said, you've got all these tectonic plates, right? And they're moving around, aren't they? Sliding around, ever so slow, because they're quite big. So you've got an inertia there, isn't you? But they move around, don't they? It's just continental drift, isn't it? I says. I think I sussed out why the Continentals drift, innit? He says, he says, oh, I see. He says, so what you reckon is that all, all the oil under the surface of the earth is what causes it to move around. I said, well, you you stick the plate on the top of a work surface, a rough old plate, mind, it won't move too far. I said, you bung a load of oil there and you give it a shove, it'll move a bit easier, won't it? I said, lubricant, innit? So that's my silly theory of why there's oil all over the planet and what it's there for. It's for the tectonic plates. Mind you, having said that now, some ego person will probably go, you can't drill for oil, you'll stop the tectonic plate movement. Uh, panic, panic. And that'll cause something else, won't it? <laughs> it'll probably become mainstream science. It's, it's, I wouldn't be surprised if we... we, we yeah, well, <laughs> nothing to surprise me these days. Anyway, cheers for now.